Walkers, joggers, and runners gathered for the fifth installment of the Base to Base Race Series recently. Fitness coordinator Jill Hathaway says the series was a great event, not only for avid runners, but for those just starting in the sport as well. There's a couple of people that I know who weren't running at all, who have come through and have completed them and have run all of the events. So it's, it's great to see it. It's great to see um, families out here. You know, we have people pushing the strollers with their little ones. Um, I know that we have a couple of um, students who weren't runners that are out here now running. Um, and I know a couple of the other women, people that I personally know, that have come out and haven't been um, runners in the past that have started it. So it's been great to see people grow with it. The race started at the Flightline Fitness Center on NAS2, went through the Italian portion of base, continued throughout the flight line, and finished back at the fitness center. Race participant, Aaron Manfredi. I'm not the greatest runner, but I, it wasn't too bad. It, six miles is always kind of scary, but uh, after you get into it, it's, it's pretty smooth. The Base to Base Race Series was designed to prepare Sig and Ellens for the Rock the Base to Base run taking place on March 12th. Seaman Steve Hill, Siganella, Italy.